si han visto un corte es porque eh, estuve un rato buscando en la tienda y resulta que toca hacer primero esto para porque no podemos abrir el candado para buscar lo otro Bueno, están ahí los dos. Ahí hay dos. Me creo que... Vale. We can probably make it over to the RV or down to the truck if we're quick and quiet about it. Where to next? Es que ir hacia allá ya había uno. Nos puede liar una. Entonces lo primero que vamos a hacer es ir a la caravana. Pues, yo creería que lo mejor es ir hacia allá. Okay, it's cool. 
quietly. Now we just have to get it quietly. <sighs> ah, coño. Y hacia el lado entonces. Igual. Golpearlo entonces. Hey man, that drew some attention. Be careful. There's a pillow over there. That's about as far as I got when it came to supply gathering. I might have an idea for it. Good luck smothering them to death. <laughs> That's not really what I have in mind. Esperamos para allá. A matarlo hasta la con la ventana esta no la golpea con la almohada what are you gonna do with that I don't really know do you have any tricks for getting into cars not without tools or making a bunch of noise and none with pillows vale vale el alma para aquí no es sofoca ¿En serio vamos a matar a un zombie ahogándolo en la almohada? Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. That was sick. Bueno, no se han enterado. No se han enterado. Just roll away. Mira, una bujía. Seguramente hubiese más cinta. Empujemos, a ver. Bueno, esta ni más interés. Sarbujia. Let me see the spark plug. Who's on inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper? Who's a lau here? Needs a parental.
Ah, oh, pues mira, tenemos el destornillador. Yo vamos para allá. Uf. As big as the Prime Walker Killer, I should be able to take those guys out when they come around the corner of the RV. Vale, ese era el que más toca, no me los cojones estaba. As big as the Prime Walker Killer. I should be able to take those guys out when they come around the corner of the RV. Ala, no. Mierda. Está muerto, sí. Me doy cuenta, a vida cuenta de ello. que es más fácil hacer esto Dude, where'd your weapon go? To that ice big sized hole <laughs> Holy shit It's cool Now we've got this Are you two done? Two more That should help You guys lie behind just in case this goes to hell. Okay, we'll be right behind you. Yo no me fiaría tanto, eh. O sea, y si quiero salir corriendo, ellos van a estar ahí en medio y me matan y ellos sobreviven. Adiós cabeza. Hello in there. We're here to help. Let's go, guys. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. She's in trouble. Miss, we're coming in. You might want to break through that board first. Vale, vale, vale. Ahora sí, vamos. Stop, just stop. I'm coming out. You're hurt. Oh God. I, I said stay away. We need to get you help. 
It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you, I said go away! I'm bit! But you couldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die, and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. Vale. You have a boyfriend? When? I don't <sighs> want that. It's not Christian. Please, just leave me. Please go. Come with us. We will find you some help. Sabemos que es una mentira, pero. You have a gun. So can I borrow it? What do you mean borrow? Give it to me. I can just, you know, end this, and then, then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. We can't let you do that to yourself. Then do it for me. We need to get going. Thomas, uh... please. This is crazy. Please step back. It's just two seconds, just one bullet, and I can be with my family, and it'll all be fine. Miss. Back up, please. Take it easy. We just want to help. You can't. Miss, just relax now. You need to think this through. We'll find you a doctor. It'll be okay. Let's all just... Oh, no, no! Vamos bien. Una bala menos. Se mató. Y... Sí, el sonido habrá traído un montón de zombies. Shit. Here they come. Get in. Sí, el sonido habrá traído un montón. La verdad es que no me acuerdo de nada, porque estuve un buen rato tirándome y hasta que me salió el alma. Tiene un par de fallos. Tengo un hacha. Vamos a preguntar qué, qué tal aquí. Vale, vale. Nada. No se preocupen. Tengo un hacha. Hablaré con ella después. Story of the century here, huh? Yeah, and I've got shit for recording equipment. And from the looks of it, there isn't going to be any shortage of first hand accounts. You do radio. That's right. Well, until some piece of shit politicians yank our funding and I hit the blogosphere. I better get back to it. Yep. <laughs> Don't mention it. Just remember what I said. Yeah. I will. Voy a intentar no repetir las conversaciones. Vamos a ver cómo está Glenn. Bueno, no, Clementine. Vamos a preocuparnos por los nuestros, ¿sabes? Uh -huh. Y ya nos ponemos manos a la obra. ¿Cómo estás, Glenn? Sabes. Yo no sé. ¿Cuál es tu próximo paso? No sé. Quiero decir, ustedes parecen bien. ¿Qué sobre tu familia? Sí, yo... Yo... Forget it, man. That's your business. I hate feeling like I can't do anything. I know the feeling, man. Eh? 
back to the motor here. How can it be that bad so fast? You know, when things are taken away, people do crazy shit. I guess. <laughs> That's not me. I'm not giving up. Not for anything. Good, man. Good. I guess you really wanted that gun. Seems like. Why didn't you tell Carly to just give it to her? It would have been a waste of a bullet. What do you mean? She was dead anyway. I'm not in the euthanasia business. Whoa, man. She was a person. She's gone now anyway. Do you know the combination for the lock on the gate outside? Mm, no me gusta esa respuesta. Oh, you know, I thought I'd go stretch my legs. You're probably better off breaking it if you have to. Try to get some rest. <laughs> yeah, right. Ah, no me gusta la respuesta que le di a este. O le hubiese dicho, ¿lo hubieras hecho tú o eso? Hubiese puesto en tesitura. A ver cómo es. Ah, paso. Hay, hay errores extraños, eh. Aquí no hay puerta trasera. No. Nope. Vale, lo, lo teníamos que intentar, eh. Bueno, ya nos dijo que estaba bien. Ahora salimos. Voy a intentar hacer solamente las cosas una vez, ¿sabes? Porque se repiten muchas conversaciones y todo no... no sé. Y aparte estoy encontrando un par de errores ahí que no me... Que no me cuadran con la historia. Venga, vámonos para afuera. Dijimos que... Para que quiera un ladrillo. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Eh, lanza el ladrillo porque el volumen está todo. Está ahí a todo volumen, pero no lo escuchan. Did 
Te tendría que gritar, ¿no? Joder, dale en la cabeza. Ya, ya, que está. Hay que estar bien seguros, joder. Después de ese grito, cualquiera. Ya lo sé, ya lo sé. Más o menos hicimos todo. Les dimos las barritas a todos los que nos queríamos llevar bien. A ver si nos cuenta algo la mujer, ¿no? Si ven, esto aún sigue activo y no. Y antes lo del mando aún no lo tenía y... Perfecto. Ahora vamos a. Oh, no. sí. La hemos liado pardísima. Se activó la alarma y claro, los ruidos van a traer a medio pueblo ahí. Exacto. Todos los zombies de la zona van a ir a por ella. hijos de puta <risa> venga yo aguanto así 
¡Hostia! ¡Ah! ¡X! Bueno, el bastón. Aguantará. A ver, ¿a quién salvamos? ¿Al tío este o a la tía? ¿Qué que le mentan en plan? ¿Duk? Ah, lo siento, Duk. Las tías primero. <risa> le dio una chocolatina a ella. ¡No! ¡Ah! Fuimos. Vale, me. Vale, mía culpa, mía culpa. Pensé que íbamos a coger el destornillador. Lo aspiramos. Vamos. Qué cabrón, nos iba a dejar tirados. Le voy a terminar aplastando la cabeza seguramente en algún momento. Vale. Que el tío la va a tomar por culo. Que el tío lo mordió a tomar por culo. Que ha muerto a tomar por culo. Ahí lo estroso. Pobre Clementine, todo lo que se tiene que estar aguantando. El niño siempre. El niño siempre ahí emocionado. Ah, oh, sí, asombroso, no sé qué, sí sé cuándo. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. A lo que tengas que hacer. Y tengo que hacer esto. Te respeto. Tú y yo estamos seguros. Este Glenn es del uh, Working Dead. Entonces... Este juego 
Este es el Glen Ayufes cuando se encuentra con Rick. Este juego se presta mucho a hacer una secuencia de solamente malas decisiones. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. Hey, about Clementine. Yeah? Earlier I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did. Well, I still think that's true. But after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are going to be just fine. Thanks, Kenny. Sí, parece más fuerte lo que es, ¿no? Considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Well, I'm sure he liked you too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? Sam? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I thought you needed the help. Ah, that makes sense. But it wasn't a choice like that. It, it was just something I did. I don't know why. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. Bueno, al menos este sabe que este le está dando la abrazo a la pobre Clementine. Hey Duck, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Hmm. Let me go deal with this. Oh, huh. man, Clementine, another thing. What do you want? You like my daughter? <laughs> Her dad tried to kill me, so... Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? <laughs> I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Bueno, este sabe quién es, quién somos. Hey, Lee, do you have a second? Sure. Mira, mira cómo me acerco. Mira cómo me toca los cojones. Sí. You can't be like that. You're only one man. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch, we can stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay.
Vale, se acabó la luz. ¡Continuará! <risa> no me acuerdo de ese continuará. Everything's going to be okay. Episodio 1. Un nuevo día. Mintieron a Herschel. Le dijimos la verdad. Duke Sean. El 30 de jugadores escogiste a Duke. Ah, vale, en la granja. Defendiste a Kenny. Ah. 52 por rechazaste la pistola. ¿47% de personas le habrían dado la pistola para que se pegue un tiro? No. Escogiste a Carly. Vale, estuvo bien. El primer episodio. Se puede decir que más o menos estuvimos casi a la media de las personas. Aunque las personas son un poquito hijas de puta porque le dieron la pistola a la chica para que se pegue un tiro. <risa> 